I'm going to show you how to get the Ghost Flame Torch. It's actually already on screen and right over there. It's a bit of a complicated jump, but I've got a tip that I think you guys will like. Before we do that, though, I just want to point out that we are in uh, Nokran. This is after defeating uh, Radan, and you will need to have beaten Radan to get down here. Um, so if you haven't done that, um, go ahead and make that a priority if this is something that you really, really wish to have. Um, with that done, then, what you'll want to do, you'll want to come to Fort Height. Um, and then kind of over this way, after defeating Radan, there'll be a big massive crater. You'll need to kind of work anti-clockwise your way down to get down. Uh, and eventually it'll, it'll spit you out here. Um, the troublesome part of this is that um, there's no grace between uh, where it just said in here. So if you fall, it's a good couple of minutes. Um, reset time, so just bear that in mind when you're doing this. So what we're going to try and do, we're going to aim for that low corner there you see. What I want you to do is I want you to press jump and then quickly put your finger onto your sprint button and hold it in. Okay? What that's going to do is when I press forward in a minute I will already be in the sprinting animation which allows us to jump um, just a little bit easier. Which means that we don't miss the jump. Okay? Um, I'm sorry I can't like give you an example. Uh, there just is not enough space for me to kind of uh, recreate that so many times. Once you've done that then we can now move over to this next one. We need another sprint jump here um, and you can use the same trick again so we can jump immediately hold sprint and then as soon as we're moving forward now we're immediately being sprint which means it's just nice and easy to get across. Okay um, so like by comparison if I don't do that like you see we have that little walk animation before we actually start sprinting. Whoops so if I do oh no 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 don't, don't dodge off that's gonna be bad. Uh, so if I just hold it down and then um, it's like, why, why is it, why is it, I don't want you to dodge. You can see that there's the walk animation right at the beginning there, yeah? But if you jump and then hold it, you're immediately in the sprint animation. So it just saves you those, those extra precious few, few frames there and allows you to get the ghost flame torch. Um, once you've gotten down here, if this is your first time down here, um, there's a few enemies that you can, you can clear through this way, which will actually make your life a little bit easier going through the zone. So hopefully that helps you guys out and I will see you all in the next video.